Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lenore, Makeup by Leo here on YouTube. If you're new to the channel, hi, welcome. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you for returning and continuing to support my channel. I truly appreciate you guys. First of all, disclaimer, if you're already noise in the background and it is my son watching um, a movie in the living room and he always has the TV like super full blast. So just an FYI, just in case, because I know sometimes people are bothered with the noise in the background and honestly like it's it's part of life okay so if you don't like it i'm sorry you can click out of the video if it bothers you but if you're here to stay hi welcome and let's jump right into this video <laughs> You guys, so my makeup look is inspired by somebody here on YouTube. I'm going to go ahead and link her channel down below if you want to check it out. I have been watching Alyssa Pope. She does some really, really pretty makeup tutorials on her channel. I'm going to go ahead and link down below her video that inspired me to do this purple look. She uses her Jaclyn Hill palette, the Jaclyn Hill Volume 2 which I use, but I use it paired along with a different eyeshadow palette. I am going to link list down below yeah. everything i have on my face i will list down below so that way you guys know what i have on my face she does a really pretty purple look on her channel and i'm just like girl and i love the way she does her blush like she'll literally match her blush to like her eyeshadow and it blends in with like seamlessly like with her makeup it looks so good i'm gonna link her video down below and that way you can check her out i love to watch her she's so amazing and yeah so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video okay so i was watching my girl the scent closet she just posted a video a couple days ago on her summer scents for summer that are like bath and body and i haven't done a little video like this in a little minute so i wanted to share with you guys some of my uh, summertime scents that i think you should pull out for the summertime these are gonna go really really well with the heat outside so we're gonna jump right into it i'm excited because i love like bath and body works fragrances i love perfume in general fragrance mist whatever but i love when it's affordable and like you can like literally get it for the low low especially when they have like summer sales some of these fragrances i don't know if they do carry them either on their website or maybe you can find them in stores it just depends because all bath and body works are different but i'm going to go ahead and just talk about a few that i truly love and then i'm going to talk about a few that she did talk about in her video so i'm going to start out with this one this is like the first one i i don't reach for this one very very often i've had it for quite some time already and it smells good like coconut but it's super strong in the coconut that i still haven't really stopped and taken time to figure out what i want to layer this with so it can give it more of a sweeter feel to it because i feel like it's very very hardcore coconut this is hibiscus paradise and this one just smells like straight coconut to me this has pink hibiscus juicy guava and sun-kissed coconut this just smells like straight up coconut to me this is really really like nice if you like coconut but i like my fragrances to be a little bit more on the sweeter side so this one i'm still trying to figure out what to pair it with so if you have any suggestions leave it down in the comments below even if it's with like a fragrance like a an actual perfume to layer it with let me know but so far this one i haven't really taken the time to do that but this is one you can pull out if you like to smell like sunscreen if you like that sunscreen smell then you would like this so this is my first choice for summertime this next one here is pastel skies and this one is more on the sweeter side it kind of gives me like a whiskey vibe these are the notes for this fragrance this is a soft berries soft cloud berries pink sponge sugar and coconut musk this does smell like coconut but more of a sweeter like whiskey type of scent it smells i don't know if that makes any sense to you guys but it kind of comes off like whiskey like to me like a little sweet and 
very coconutty but nothing like the first one this one's very different and i just think this one smells like summertime if that makes sense to you drop a comment down below and say yes that makes sense but this is what it's giving me and this one's really nice so this is one you should pull out this next one here is a sunset glow and this one has notes of fresh coconut sparkling cherry seltzer and caramelized vanilla this reminds me a lot of the ariana grande perfume what is it called thank you next 2.0 it kind of reminds me of that perfume this is sweet it's caramelly and it's coconutty it's really nice i feel like the the name for this fragrance mist is perfect and it just smells like summer this one smells so good this one's also on the sweeter side so i do like this i think because of the caramel in here it gives it that sweeter vibe too so this one is one you should pull out for the springtime girl okay this one here is golden hour coast this one has notes of sunkissed bergamot golden pear and radiant woods this one's sweet it i smell the pear in it like if you like pear you'll like this it's not like like a super strong pear it's just like a soft sultry scent and i feel like this is nice for like a nighttime summer day even if you're taking a walk on the beach i think this would be pretty to wear to the beach like for a walk on the beach and you're walking with your partner girl i think this would smell good this one's really really nice and i just i'm obsessed with this one i used it a lot last summer and um this is where i'm at so i don't know i just might use that much more this summer but this one smells really really good and this is one you should definitely pull out for the summertime because it smells amazing it also gives like a perfume vibe to it to be honest but it's really nice like it's not like a super strong perfumey type of scent it's like a soft sultry scent you can wear on a date night for summer so i really really enjoy that one this next one i've had for a long time like it's been a long time since i have had this one if you watch my old youtube videos you will see in the background i literally have this in the background i've had it for years but it still smells good this one's just it's exactly what it is island margarita the name is tiki bay island margarita i don't have the notes on this one but this one's just it smells like pineapple like a pineapple margarita that's what this smells like it smells really really good i love it um i just don't wear it as often because i have so many like fragrance mist and perfumes that i forget to pull these out especially because now i have them like in a drawer i don't have them on displayed on a shelf so i have to pull the drawers out and kind of go through what i have and i haven't been doing that so I'm just being honest guys but this one smells so good pineapple margarita this is good for like a date night with your girlies so this one's nice i love 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 that one i just don't wear it as often but i do have the lotion that i like to pair it with and my stuff still smells good it doesn't smell bad or anything so that's that this next one here is called Pearberry and this one has notes of Andrew pear wild berries apple blossom golden freesia and blonde wood some people don't like freesia I want to say that the scent closet might have said in one of her videos that she doesn't like the way freesia mixes with her chemistry so if you don't like freesia you might not like this one but I like freesia I feel like it mixes well with my skin and this one it just smells honestly like a coconut fragrance I do get a little bit of the pear in there but for some reason this smells like coconut to me and it has nowhere in here it says it has coconut but this reminds me of summer like summer hot heat and sunscreen like that's what this reminds me of but I think this one's pretty and I haven't used much of it much of it <laughs> I haven't used much of it lately because like I said I have so many fragrance mists that I gravitate towards certain ones like a lot of the time so 
these i'm going to try to use a lot more now that it's summertime and the heat is just like booming and beaming girl but this one smells like coconut to me it smells similar to this one to hibiscus paradise but this one's sweeter like this is like a sweet coconut vibe so i like this one and i think you should pull it out for the springtime i mean the summertime girl here we have sea island shore and this one's more of like a clean very it kind of reminds me of cleaning products not to like try and say if that's a bad thing it's not not in a bad way it just smells very very clean like this says it has notes of clean cotton orange blossom blue freesia and ocean musk and i do enjoy this one i just don't wear it very often i wear it more so when i get out of the shower this is very very strong and i feel like it just smells super clean it's nothing like coconutty or anything like that so that is not this um this is just something i would wear for the summertime because it's so clean and fresh and i feel like it would smell good during the summertime with all the heat and everything and here in texas the heat gets super crazy humid sticky so i feel like scents like that will kind of like keep you smelling fresh all day so yeah so this one here is one in a million and this is this has notes of jasmine extract tuberose oil white gardenia pink pepper cashmere musk this one here is more of a floral scent this is more perfumey this one smells really really good if you are into gardenia and jasmine tuberose those type of scents you will like this one because it smells like all of those in one this is a really really good fragrance mist i haven't used much of it because i haven't had it like a long long time this is um newer to my collection but it it came out a long time ago and this one it just smells like a really nice gardenia tuberose perfume it smells really nice and i feel like this is good to use for a day out like if you're dressed up a little bit and you want to smell fresh and clean and pretty perfumey this is the vibe so that's one in a million this next one body ecologies blue denim this is not bath and body work blue denim and this has notes of blue freesia and juicy clementines this one i really really enjoy this one this one i got mm, not too long ago i want to say i've had it for maybe a month or two maybe a, maybe about two months and i've used a, a quite a bit of this one i like to wear this one this one's just nice i wear it like when i'm on the go just something fresh to put on like say i take a shower and i'm on my way to run errands and i'm not wearing makeup or anything just on the go trying to get things done i do wear this one i'll pull i'll just spritz myself with it especially because i keep it on my on my area where i keep my perfumes so this one i've been using more so lately and this one smells really good i do like this one i enjoy it i think it's fresh clean and it's good for summertime this is another one you can pull out for the summertime i don't use this one all that too often but this one is a good one i just don't reach for it as much this one's super super old this one's been around for a long time this packaging is super old packaging I don't care it smells good to me and I've had it for a long time because like I said I have so many fragrances or fragrance mist that it's kind of hard to get through them but um, this one is this one's cool and bright from pink and this one has notes of fresh magnolia and bergamot, bergamot splash this smells really really good it kind of reminds me of the ed hardy perfume i wore it to work one time and well not one time I, I wore it over several times but when i wore it to work one day one of my friends was like what is it that you're wearing it smells really really good and i was like oh it's this one and i showed her the bottle it's from victoria's secret and she was like girl that smells like the ed hardy perfume you know what i'm talking about and i'm like yeah i know which one you're talking about i used to wear that perfume back when i was like i don't know in like my early 20s i think and it smells really really good and i haven't came across it but if i do i will pick it up i usually carry it in ross but this one 
smells just like that one so these next four that i'm going to mention they'll just be honorable mentions because that was already 10 fragrances to begin with but this one is one that i just i love to wear especially like with with it being hot like i feel like this one smells really really good this is a white t-shirt i feel like this is a lot of people's favorites this has crisp hair fresh white t-shirt lavender cloud clean musk and soft sandalwood this one smells like sandalwood to me and it smells super super fresh i feel like a guy could wear this because it's it smells very unisex it's such like it gives like cologne vibes to me and i just feel like it smells super super good i feel like both men and women could wear this and i mean you can wear whatever you want but i feel like this is good for like men and women like it smells very very unisex okay and these three are the ones that the scent closet uh shows in her video i'm gonna link her video down below so if you want to watch her video i'll go ahead and do that so you guys can check it out but i love to watch her channel she has some really good combination uh perfume combinations on her channel and she also just she just has a good channel if you like fragrance so go and check her out but she mentioned poppy poppy is really sweet this is a sweet fragrance this has fresh morning dew wild poppy sugar rhubarb and juicy pear this one smells really really pretty it's just it's like a sweet perfume type of scent to me and this is i feel like this is good for the for the summertime i feel like it'll go well with the summer heat she also mentioned at the beach which i don't wear too often but this kind of gives me coconut vibes it does have coconut this one has notes of white fragapani fragapani is that how you say it white fragapani blossom toasted coconut bergamot water sea salt breeze and sun sun-kissed musk this one it smells like coconut to me it's like a a whole coconut vibe i feel like this is nice for the summer very sunscreeny very just it kind of reminds me of hibiscus paradise again but this one i feel like is let me see yeah i feel like these two they smell very very similar except this one has a slightly like a very itty bitty type of difference to it but it smells good to me and you should wear it for summertime and then last but not least this is fresh getaway this one smells so good this has bright yutsu citrus and ocean fresh ocean air Get away to the coast with the refreshing fragrance that crisp, clean, and beaming with sunny and warm. Okay, so this one, it also gives me like unisex vibes. I feel like these two smell more cologne. I feel like this one's a little bit more toned down than this one. I feel like this one gives way more cologne vibes, but this one's more toned down. But they both feel, they, they're both unisex feels. So she did mention this one. Uh, no, I've used this one more than this one. So white t-shirt is one of my favorites to wear when I get out of the shower and I just want to smell fresh and clean. This one as well, it's uh, good for on the go. Very nice scent. I feel like this one's so good. Like these two are so good. Like all of these are good. Like you should try, if you have these in your collection, definitely put them out and use them for the summertime because I feel like these will go really, really well for the summer. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. And share with me down in the comments any fragrances that you think would go well with the summertime heat. See you on the next one. Which one of ice? <laughs> That's funny.